Hi friends, it's Shell, the Tape Queen. My goodness, it's been well over, a little over a month since I've made a video. And I've missed uh, visiting with all of you, but meanwhile, I've been having a just wonderful time with my mom. She was here for an entire month to have a visit with us and it was a long overdue one so due to uh, some uh, major uh, health problems she'd had and some things that we had had in our lives we just couldn't make a connection for a long time so oh, it was just indescribable to be able to have that time with her um, it just meant so much to me so we uh, cherished every minute of it so um, and while she was here we got to have her 80th birthday party um, she was a Valentine baby so on Valentine's Day we celebrated her 80th birthday and that was really special so um, we just had a lot of very uh, special moments that made wonderful memories for us so anyhow um, but I had a few things that I wanted to show you today and um, just after my mom left I received some happy mail and this beautiful card from Paige who is Stamp Girl 3 here on YouTube and I'll link that below Paige, it was just perfect timing to have this card come when it did. Um, you know, I had such a wonderful, wonderful visit with my mom, but it sure was hard to let her go home. So, I appreciate this card so much. Um, it couldn't have come at a better time. Um, it's not that I was sitting around depressed or anything. I, I recognize that, you know, my mom couldn't stay here or anything, but it was really nice to have something special come in the mail right when I needed it. So thank you very, very much. This card is so pretty. Um, it looks dark here in the camera to me, um, but it's a beautiful kind of teal colored card stock. And this is... Uh, dry embossed here this background and then this layer is punched out and uh, got a pretty flowy hair with glitter on it and then this matching border and it's all glittered a little scallop there below it everything's so beautifully coordinated and then the inside is all coordinated with the outside well this is just she wrote her note on this cute little B paper so that she left the inside blank and this is a dry embossed piece strip here and then this um, die cut uh, top note like I think that's what those are called at least um, from Stampin' Up! but anyhow I think she left it blank in case I wanted to use it for someone else but I think I'll keep it just because it's special and um, thank you so very much Paige that really meant a lot to me and next what I want to show you I'll keep this here so you have something pretty to look at while I'm talking for a minute um, Lori who is crafty Lori here on YouTube has something on her channel that's called Let the Wishing Begin and you can go to this and you can people uh, put in their two wishes and for things and you can either fulfill someone's wishes or you can have your wishes fulfilled and I've been blessed to be able to do both I've had some wishes, a couple wishes fulfilled, which I'll show you in a minute. 
and I've been able to fulfill some wishes, so both are really fun. It's a lot of fun to receive, but it's even more fun to give, so anyhow, it's a really fun thing to do, and thank you, Lori, for uh, starting such a fun thing, and I'll link uh, her channel below, so you can go over and check that out if you haven't. And uh, the first thing I received was from Amanda, who is Amanda K. Crafts and Plans here on Crafts slash Plans here on YouTube, and I'll link her channel below. And I had wish wished for some narrow washi tape. And um, look at how pretty it is on the back of the envelope from her. Isn't that pretty? I just thought that was so pretty. And then, um, there again, she used that same washi on a card she has with very pretty penmanship. And then a really pretty note card for me. Love those colors. So pretty. And then inside the note card, she has that pretty washi and the same beautiful gold flower again. Thank you, Amanda. That's so pretty. And then she followed through with that same pretty washi. There. And this is all the beautiful narrow washi that she shared with me. Because I don't have any narrow washi. All oh, mine is, you know, the standard size. So thank you so very much, Amanda. I'm going to have fun using this. I'm uh, really looking forward to playing with that. So, really, really appreciate your sharing with me and your beautiful presentation. That was very pretty when we did it all up. And then I wished for some pearl stamens because I have some flowers I want to try making. And Christine, who is Shabby Pink House, many of you know her here on YouTube, and I'll link her below also. She sent me this huge bundle of uh, pearl stamens. A lot of them there. I should be able to make plenty of flowers for a long time there. So she sent me those. And uh, so I'm going to make some flowers. And if they turn out the way I hope they will, I'll be sharing the flowers here on YouTube. So thank you so very much, Christine, for sending me those and for your generosity and, and uh, in uh, sending me so many. I really, really wanted to be able to make those flowers and I sure appreciate your being so generous with me just sending a gift from your heart like that. So thank you very much. Thank you all three ladies so much. And, uh, you know, just for, you know, just bringing a, some joy into my day and doing something special for me. I appreciate it so much. It means the world to me. So I'll talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.